Okay, we're going to try to do number eight. This is on page 268 in the hyperbolic geometry activities. And it says I'm supposed to start by making a line. So I make a hyperbolic line. And they want you to notice that this point C and this point D, they're on the Poincare disk, which means they're out going out to infinity. Okay, so that's kind of the. They're out there on the on the event horizon. They're out there going to infinity. And then it says I'm supposed to construct another line not on this line. So I'm just gonna there and there. There's another line. Woohoo! And then they're gonna want us to to drag this. Now notice. Notice as I drag it, I haven't intersected, I haven't intersected. I don't intersect until this point H down here gets on, uh, aligns with D. So I'm, you know, we get there and then, oh, there, it finally intersected. Finally intersected. So, but all through here, the line is not intersecting. There's no, so what does that mean about parallelism? Well, that must mean that there's a lot of lines that are parallel if we define parallelism to be two line parallel lines to be two lines that don't intersect so this line doesn't intersect that line doesn't intersect etc now they're going to also want us to do a construction where we construct two lines we construct that one wait my bad back it up we construct this line here and we construct this line there and what you'll notice um, is that if I grab and drag this line the it, it, it's like a boundary this line won't intersect a B until I get to right there and then it intersects once it crosses that boundary there and then then I've got an intersection same is true over here I got to swing it around but once I cross that then the line intersects on the other side and what these are called are limiting parallel rays. So this ray here, and perhaps I could, we could make it, um, let's see if we can do, um, let's make it red. And maybe we can make it super thick. Okay, that'll work. So that line there, and then let's do this one here. Let's make it super thick and let's make it mm, green so those are what are called um, limiting parallel rays and that means that as that, as long as this line isn't getting across those par uh, limiting parallel rays it's not intersecting with this other line that we're interested in okay so that's interesting because now all of a sudden there are a bunch of lines as I move it around. There, each one of, as I move it, it's representing an infinite number of lines that are parallel to our first line, which is crazy nuts, cocoa nuts. Think about that. Don't let your head explode. Okay, we're going to do some more later. Anyway, this was number eight. See you in a bit.